Greetings, my princess. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Um, you are a mature girl, and there's something I want to discuss with you. Um, you can go ahead, my princess. Okay. I want you to know that whatever I'm going to tell you right now, I support you 100%, so you don't need to be afraid. Okay, my princess. Prince of former likes you. Hey. What? Yes. He's waiting for you right now. I want you to go to the garden. Meet him up. He will declare his intentions. Yes. My princess, I, I, I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. Just do as I say and he will tell you the rest. Hey. Hey. My princess, this is difficult for me to do. Good things in life comes in difficult forms. Go ahead. Thank you, my princess. Let me. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> I pray this works. I really wish this can work. This is the reason why you just have to live a decent life as a woman. Oh, God help me, please. I don't know what to say. This was the least I expected to hear today. You don't have to say anything. Just accept. Say it. I will love you beyond reasonable doubt. I will love you like a queen. Please, say it. Uh, accept, please. I, I, I accept. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. You have no idea. I'm happy, thank you. I will love you for the rest of my life. Thank you. Afoma. Yes, Father. I have not seen you this happy before. <laughs> have you seen the three billion naira you have been looking for? <laughs> No, father, but I got something way bigger. Really? Yes, mother. Father, you have always wished for me to get uh, acquainted with a girl that will make me act more responsible. That is correct. Women that are well trained can make even the devil become more responsible. That I know. Wait a minute, son. Have you found a woman you want to marry? Something very close to that, mother. Are you serious? Um, with your permission, father, let me just go and fetch her immediately. Wow. Go ahead, my son. <laughs> 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 I'm so happy. <laughs> Father, uh, mother, here she is. Of all the girls in our community, you chose a maiden? Yes, father. She is the only one that gladdens my heart. Mother, isn't she beautiful? In that case, you, you have my blessings. Ah. <laughs> Excuse me. Thank you, father. <clears throat> Mama, are you okay? You'll be fine. Thank you. Thank you, Dad. What is it? I observed the Queen closely when we were making the introduction, and I discovered she does not like me. Why would you say that? My mom is my twinny. 
she likes everything I like. So if I like you, it means she likes you. I hope so. You know the Queen is a strong woman. I don't want to go to war with her. She will crush me. Don't worry yourself. Hmm? If she doesn't like you, it is my duty to make her like you. Hmm? Thank you. <clears throat> I'll be on my way right now. Sleep well. It's in my place. Hi. Good night. Greetings, my prince. How are you? I'm fine. You look dull this morning. Are you alright? I have not been able to sleep. I've been thinking about you. <laughs> Same here. Have you seen your period? No, my period ended seven days ago. Yes, seven days. What is this? I'm sorry, my prince. Let me go and quickly take care of myself. Still asleep. I came to say good morning and also know how you're doing. There's a problem, oh. 
What is it? What is it? Mercy, I can't find her. What? What do you mean you can't find her? She wasn't in our room when I woke up this morning. I've looked for her, but I can't find her anywhere. Did you ask the guards to know if she left the palace very early this morning? Yes, I have. And they said no one has left the premises from last night till now. Hey! Mm. This is not a good news at all. No. What do we do? Um, let's wait a little more. If after two or three hours she did not return, we will report to the Queen. I, I think that's a good idea. Let's wait. Uh -uh. Mercy, did you say you did not see her? No, I can't find her. Where could she be now? Uh -uh. Was it not Mercy I was discussing with? Love, lost for power, hey. brings this unity in our midst. Love, lost for power, brings this unity in our midst. Courtesy demands that if you're coming into a room that is not yours, you knock. Apologies, mother. But I... Why are you like someone who is being pursued? Mother, father is done with the strangeness again. What? When did it start? I went to check on him this morning, only to see blood gushing out from his nose. But I thought the DBA said that the strange illness is coming. Mother, there is no time. My father is dying. These questions are... It's much. okay. It's okay. Go and call your brother. Eh? Both of you should meet me in your father's chamber. Okay. okay. Love lost for power brings this unity in our midst. Love lost for power Brings this unity in our midst. It can make us kill one another. Too much blood will flow like a river. It can make us turn against each other. Breaking the bonds we share. to make him love you. <laughs> what do you mean by that? It is no longer a secret that you've been frolicking with Prince Ofoma. I thought you have something important to say. Ngozi. Mm. Prince Ofoma means the world to me. Oh yes, all along. I have my eyes on him, so stay away from him. And if I don't... <laughs> I will punish you severely. I will make you regret ever coming to serve in this palace. You can't do anything. The priest came for me. He asked me for a relationship. I accepted. It is you that should take your eyes off him. <laughs> Ngozi, you just challenged me to a fight. But you know what? I do enjoy challenges. So, this fight begins this moment. Oh, 
I know she hated you for your good luck. But we want in a setting. God's will must be established. Thank you, my friend. Thank you so much. Don't worry. When you're done, you can come in full sight. Uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. I'm almost drunk. Right. Thank you. What is this? Your father is under attack again. But I thought the DBS said this attack would not reoccur. The same question I asked mother in her chamber. Ezema, please, excuse us. I would like to have a word with your brother. What? Mother, I am the first son. Any discussion about the king should be done right in my presence. Yes, I know. Fine. Mm. Then, find the solution to your father's problem. First son, excuse me. Right, right, fine. All right, fine. Excuse you. Mother. Mother, that, that was not necessary. You and I know we can always talk about anything in your chambers. Son. We have limited time. Your father is almost gone. You have to start positioning yourself for the throne. This is the second time you are telling me this, mother. I don't understand. The gods have chosen you to rule after your father's death. So like I said, you have to start getting ready because you are the only one who can fight your father's enemies in seven days, the journey to the throne begins. Mother, <laughs> this is too complicated. There is no way on this earth my brother would allow this happen. He is the first son. And he will willingly give you the throne at the right time. What is it? You don't look happy. My mother and my brother are ganging up against me. What exactly did they do this time? My father is down again with these strange emails. But the steps they are taking to get him recovered, they don't want me to know about it. I said it! I said it! My love, it is obvious they are shutting you out of your rights. Are you just going to sit there and allow it to happen? No way! Very good. Now listen. This is the time for you to be a man. You have to start taking decisions. Because if anything happens to your father right now, I'm pretty sure they will crown your brother as king. What? No, yes. no, 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 honey. Don't, 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 don't think about it. Don't go there. Okay. Because if that should happen, I will kill. I will maim. I will... I'm coming. Where, where are you going? Honey, don't worry. I will explain to you when I come back. <laughs> oh my 
my god this is just the beginning the crisis has just set in i am going to fuel it that the fire will consume you and that stupid brother of yours I want to fight your brother. I want to fight your father. Let's see how it happens. Uh, Nam, the king is done. You understand? With the look of things, he will not survive it this time. Listen, there is no probability on his recovery this time around. He will certainly die. In fact, as we speak, he is dead already. <laughs> okay, now, uh, if that happens, yeah. what next? Very simple. Ezemwa is going to ascend the throne. No, but Cynthia will poison him. Uh, and he will die. Uh, when he dies, or former himself, will he only die mysteriously. In fact, he will just die in this land and nobody can explain what happened to him. Okay. Then, okay. you will ascend the throne. And the Cynthia will become your queen. Idiot! If I say that you are a genius, I might sound as though you are belittling me by calling me a genius because I'm actually an advanced genius. I think very far. I will be king. Prepare to be king. King is almost crossing over to join the ancestors. Is there anything you can do to prevent him from joining his ancestors? It is not me. Or your mother. Only the queen can help the king. My mother? Yes. How? Go back to your mother. Plead with your mother to try as much as she can to bring the king back. Love lost for power brings this unity in our midst. Love lost for power brings this unity in our midst. Why is the king not still awake? This calabash has to be filled with blood before the ritual of restoration will be completed. You want another human sacrifice? No. You have already made a sacrifice. Once a day, because it bleeds through her vagina, and I take the blood with this calabash. Once it's filled to the brim, the ritual of restoration be completed and Ngozi will die. Um, please, how long will it take this calabash to be filled up? Not too long. She is bleeding for today. Ngozi, you need to be very careful with Sophia. You should have seen the way she was looking at you with so much disdain when we were discussing Mercy's disappearance. I know. She's only being jealous. Still, you need to be careful. Sophia is someone that can do anything, anything to get what she wants. I know. I'll be careful. Thank you. You're welcome. So how are things with the prince? <laughs> it's been lovely. <laughs> the prince is a wonderful person. The thought of him makes me miss him. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm so happy for you. Thank My sister, you. I enjoy you. Please. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Um, nothing. I'll, I'll talk to you later. Okay. We were just having a nice and pleasant conversation and then her countenance changed. While the royal family is doing everything to make sure he's back on his feet, the heir apparent, Prince Ezenwa, will be overseeing to all the activities. I called you all here to inform you. Okay. For how long has the king been sick? Today is the second day. And based on what you know, do we have any chance that the king will be up on his feet anytime soon? Yes. I'm optimistic that he will soon be back on his feet. Your Majesty, is the chief priest aware of this situation? Yes. I was with the chief priest yesterday and he assured me that the king will be well soon. Mm. Oh, that sounds mm. to me like good news. Okay. <laughs> Greetings, Your Majesty. Greetings, my dear. Wow. She's beautiful. Yes, Mom. She is very beautiful. Well, my dear. I want you to know that you are welcome to my home. <laughs> it's obvious my son, Prince of Oma, loves you so dearly. And I can't stop him. <laughs> so I'm left with no other option than to accept you as my own. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. <laughs> Thank you, Majesty. Oh, get up, get up. Oh. Royalty beckons on you. And you cannot approach it on bended knees. Hmm? You're welcome. Thank you, Your Majesty. Soon you will stop working as a maid. And um, you will start wearing some royal apparels. Okay? Welcome. Thank you, Your Majesty. Thank you, Mom. From the look of things, I think the king is there. Yes, and uh, that is a very good opportunity for us to take some forward steps towards taking over the throne. Definitely. I am thinking this is the right time for us to give Cynthia the responsibility of taking Ezenwa out of the way. And I hope she can do that without traces. Why not? She has done things like this countless number of times with significant success. In fact, I can confirm to us that she is a professional. In that case, it should be needless wasting time. Order her to kill Ezenwa immediately. Get Ezenwa out of the way. Certainly, you know I will. 
Kan det være, der er kun? Happy. In fact, come on, baby, rejoice with me. Of course, you know I am rejoicing with you. Come on, darling, what are you saying? <laughs> but of course, you know that I am super duper excited for you. Yes, honey. Come on. But come to think of it, yes, baby. you know, with the secret meeting between Oforma and your mother, I thought they were going to take you right. Honey, they don't there. No. <laughs> if they try that, do you know what that means? No, no, no. They have to respect, I mean, obey the tradition of my land, our land. Yes. If they don't, that will amount to death to both of them. Good. Yes. I am happy for you. Really, really happy. I'm happy for you. <laughs> You're happy for me. But of course you know I'm happy for you. Sure, baby, that you're happy for me. It's happy, my love. If you're happy for me, you know what to do. <laughs> Come here. Mm. <laughs> you're not. You no, 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 no. Oh, sorry. <laughs> mm, that's my love. Mm -mm. Love you, baby. I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, uh, I am more than happy. Seriously, right now I am. No, we are in, in charge, in control of things. Everything. <laughs> Sweet. Come on, take it. Mm. Oh, God. What is it? Only my father. I love my father so much. I want him to get back to his faith. I want my father to get back to his faith. Listen to me. By the grace of God, nothing will happen to your father. He will be fine. Absolutely fine. Okay? In my prayer, yes. He will be fine. Come on, darling. Don't spoil this this beautiful moment. Let's drink. Drink up, my love. <laughs> Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Let's see. Oh. Say that again. Yes. We are in charge. I love the way you say it. Honey. We. Uh-huh. Oh. Uh-huh. In. Uh-huh. Charge! <laughs> You know what, honey? I am taking you to Bahamas next week. Come Thank you. You said there is something you wanted us to talk about. Yes. What is it? Um, the night before the king became ill. That same night you introduced me to the family. I left your chambers and was going to the maiden's quarters when I saw Alex heading towards the king's door with something I suspected to be a charm. Are you sure of what you're talking about? Yes, I have no reason to lie against him. Did he see you? No. I hid myself at a corner along the corridor. With a strange illness. The same night you performed the ritual, she saw Alex squatting by father's door with a charm. 
Alex is the most senior and trusted guard in this palace. Do you think he could do a thing like that? Our family has been under severe attack. And I wonder who is helping our enemies sneak in their weapons of destruction into our palace. Son, give meaning to your words. All I am trying to say, Mother, is simple. I trust no one. Well, in that case, you and your brother will have to find out from Alex what he knows about your father's sickness. What is it you said you want to tell me? My prince. Miss is missing. Yes. Since when? Since the day I was introduced to the royal family as Prince of Oma's friend. Have you called her line or tried to reach any of her family member? My prince, her phone is still in our quarters. We both slept on the same bed that night, but when I woke up in the morning, she was gone. And ar around what time did you wake up that day? At 5 a.m. as always, my prince. Uh, like I asked before, have you tried to reach any of her relatives? Yes, my prince. Her mother called this morning. I picked her call. She requested to speak with her daughter. But I didn't know what to tell her. Uh, that means uh, she, she have uh, absconded with her boyfriend, one of them. No, my prince. Mercy has no reason to abscond with a man. She does not have a boyfriend. In fact, I'm the only friend she has. I'm the only friend. Um, it, it's okay. It's, it's okay. I... I've heard you. We'll find her. Yes. Is that okay now? Yes, yes my, my prince. prince. It's, it's alright then. You may leave. Thank you, my prince. Thank you. Love lost for power brings this unity now. Lost for power brings this unity in our midst. It can make us kill one another. Not that killed that girl. Like a river. God, this it is not happening. Turn against each other, breaking. Where is my brother? Well, I sent for you, not him. What do you want? Good question. A very quick one. Is it wrong for a girl to do one or two things to earn a living? Yes, it is very, very wrong. You're a woman, which means you are supposed to be decent. Oh. Because you do not know the family you will end up with. Now, just a quick one. Okay, shoot. If you had one or two with my father in the past, 
Do you think he will accept you as a daughter-in-law now if I bring you home to introduce to him as my wife-to-be? Well, I'm glad you said your father. I've done nothing with your father. So why the hatred? You're so dumb. I thought you were intelligent. Now let me say this to you. I will never be alive. And watch my brother marry you. Never. I see. That is not even the case. Missy is the victim of her sorcery this time. How did you know that? Missy is missing. And I'm certain mother used her for sacrifice. Jesus Christ! Just stop it! Stop! How can you say anything like that? Now this is a huge accusation. It's not an accusation, it's the truth. Um, how did you know about this? That's Cynthia's voice. I think it's coming from your room. I did not attempt to rape anybody. What you saw in there is a total display of a very good actress. How will anyone believe you? I mean, as anyone said, he saw both of you in a very compromising situation. So how do you expect anybody to believe you? I do not care what anybody believes. That girl set me up. But before this is over, she will feel my wrath. I believe you. I believe you. I mean, I, I know Cynthia back in the days. She was a terrible person. I believe you. That girl will do anything just to cement her stay in this palace. She has initiated a very dangerous and deadly game. 
but little did she know that dangerous and deadly game is my food. So, what do you intend to do now? to your brother and his wife to be. I will do no such thing, mother. Mother, you see, he's still claiming right. I will deal with this boy in this house. You will do exactly as I have said it, O former. And I said I will do no such thing, mother. I will never have anything to do with your thing, let alone rape. She only cooked up that drama to pitch you against me. And you foolishly fell for that drama. You bought her a cheap and deceitful display. How disappointing. Okay. Then speak to me, damn it! Will you stop it? Stop it! This. this is the throne room. If you want to display your madness, go outside! Yes! A phone. Why are you being very stubborn in this? I am not being stubborn, mother. My problem here is you do not believe me. But that is not my problem. You just dared me by trying to rip my woman. The battle line is drawn. Go and prepare. Come back here, white boy. I do not need to prepare for you. I have you. I will fix you. Get out. Mother, I don't believe a former tried to rape that girl. How do you know? I know Cynthia. I know her back in the days while we were in school. Cynthia is a wrong girl that specializes in arranging girls for politicians. How do you expect the truth to come out from such a girl? Saburuchu, do you expect me to believe that? Mommy, I just told you the truth. And you think I will believe that your truth? That truth is a lie. Why did you not say it before now? Sit down and shut up. Have you ever asked me for sex and I did not give it to you? I have never asked because I know you're a virgin. Does being a virgin stop me from having sex with the man I've given my heart to? Where is all this coming from? What is the problem? Why did you want to rape another man's wife to be? I did not attempt to rape anyone. She set me up. Everything you see her doing out there is to create an enmity between I and my brother. And why would she want to do a thing like that? I have been at war with that girl ever since she set her feet into this palace. She is a low class, no life, prostitute. A whore, dirty spirit, and now she is looking for a decent man to set it on with. She will not see my brother. I was disappointed when I heard you attempted to rape her, so I came to give it to you all night. Hey, hey. No. No. Look. 
I did not attempt to rape her. I swear to you, I swear by everything that we share. She's cooking up with this. She is plotting this. She wants to create a beef between her and my brother. And that is what she has just done. In that case, you have to be very careful. I don't want anything to happen to you. Nothing will happen to me. I'll be careful. Okay, um, should I stay or should I go back to my quarters? In as much as I would want you to stay, please, you have to go back to your quarters. I'll see you in the morning. Is there one? Is there one? Good morning. Look, I will never attempt to rape your woman. Never. I don't need any explanation from you. Just have it at the back of your mind that we're at war. And I will do anything to get back at you. Well understood. What if I tell you that? I know who is responsible for all the attack on our family. Who? You have said so many disgusting things about me to the Queen. But the good thing is she does not believe you. That is a defeat. So why don't you just go away? Prince Ofoma and I are fighting so hard to get you out of this palace. <laughs> really? Well, I have taken good care of Ofoma. And I assure you, if you continue in this step of yours, <laughs> it will be disastrous. I said it. I said it that you are a dangerous person. But you know what? I can assure you, we will defeat you. What I did to a former is season one of my movie. So, Puruji, season two is loading for you. And I will watch it at my comfort zone. I know your kind. Fine. Fine. Then be ready to dance the dance of the spirit. I will be waiting. information from you. Mm. But I'll try being nice. 
Tell us, who are you working for? Who sent you? <laughs> you idiot! You idiot! Come to that! You can go to hell for all I care! If you are going to be a weakling, then you will go and not let me do this. And now you do what? We're killing him. Give us the information. We're talking. He was about dying. Are you surprised seeing my brothers together? <laughs> Don't worry. Very soon, you will be exposed. Now, I'll tell you something about blood. No matter how they fight, they will always bond. Your time is up in this palace. If I were you, I will fly. You don't worry. You will soon be exposed. Excuse me. did it go? You confessed to dropping the jam by the king's door. Did he drop some names? He didn't say. Then go ask him to give you names. We are working seriously on that mother. Soon, very soon he will talk. Do not let anything happen to him. Because if he dies, we will lose the thrill. We understand, Mother. How is Father? He will be fine. It's just a matter of time. Standing here for over five minutes looking outside. What is the problem? I am checking out my security network. I need to be sure it is tight. Why are you so security conscious? Life without security is exposure to danger. You are right. Alex, did he confess? Yes. Jesus. Hey. How could he be so mean to the king who has treated him like his own son? How? That is life for you. I have always learned that about life. 
the same people you will kill yourself for. The same people you will take a bullet for. Are the same people that will turn around to wish you dead without thinking twice. Hmm. This is serious. Hey, where is he now? He's chilling in somewhere very, very conducive. You know I'm not supposed to be here by this time. Hey, you know I'm just a maiden. What is wrong with you? Hey, hey, hey. Let us be the first and the last time you address yourself as a maiden. You are a princess. A queen to be. The bride of a former. Come in. Greetings, my prince. How are you? I'm fine, my prince. I am standing by. Let's go, I'm ready. So, um, where is the food? At the dining, I will pick it as we are leaving. Oh, okay, I'll join you. All right. I brought you food. But before you eat this food, you have to tell us the people or who you're working with. Five seconds to make up your mind or you die.
Now listen to me. Today is your day of grace. By the time we go and come back, you refuse to tell us who you're working with. To be your day of judgment. I I was out there in the compound taking some fresh air. Oh yeah. I I woke up and I didn't find you. Where were you? I actually want to check my father. Is he awake? No, I do that every morning and night. Oh, darling, you are a true son of your father. <laughs> you can't say that again. You know, I love my father so much. I know. And I missed you while you were away. Sure. <laughs> yes! <clears throat> How is your father? <laughs> <sighs> my father. I believe he'll be fine. He will, seriously. But of course he will be fine. <laughs> You're looking more pretty at this night. What is the secret? But of course you know I am beautiful. Yes, you are, but this night's own is exceptional. Oh, really? Come get me. Do you know what? Do you know what? <laughs> what? I know you'll give me a handsome boy. Very handsome. And a pretty daughter. In fact, prettier than you. Okay, but I want a boy first. Mm hmm. A I boy. I want a princess first. No, we're getting <laughs> a boy! You look very angry. Is it not that stupid girl a call in uh, Ngozi? <laughs> What did she do? <laughs> she wants to take the prince away from me. I need to warn her to stay away from the prince. Don't do that. 
I will be left with no choice than to fight her. Did I hear you say fight? Yes. Ifoma, I will fight her. I will naked her. In fact, I will beat her like a child. Forget the size. Remember that fighting is prohibited in this palace. Hmm? If you fight, you lose your job. Exactly what I want. Ngozi and I will lose our job. Then we will leave the palace and she will no longer see the prince. Yes. Tofia, it's not a good idea. Don't do this, please. I should not do this. See, my mind is made up. No going back. Sophia! <laughs> is it by force to marry Prince? You won't force yourself, eh? <laughs> oh! I heard everything she said. And so? Let me advise you. You better advise her to change her mind. Else, she incurred the wrath of the king upon herself. And what business of yours is it? Hmm? Won't you go and mind your post? Yes, it is not my business, but at least I've spoken my mind. that whoever is responsible or behind all this is very serious and is aware that we're here last night. In that case, we must leave you at once. Let's go. Let's go. planted a charm by the king's door. What? So where is Alex now as we speak? They, they took him to an undisclosed destination. Asiopi, I'm afraid he might not return alive. If anything should happen to my son, I swear on the gods of this kingdom, I am I'm going to wipe out the entire royal family. So what do we do now? Just hold on here. As they are holding Alex captive, we are going to continue with our plan. Take this. What do I do with this? When you open it, you will see some powdery substance inside it. Drop it on what Princess Emma will eat or drink. And he will die after a few days and nobody will suspect anything. Go. Cool. About Don't worry about him, I will handle it myself. You may leave, there is no time. I agree with you that those fighting against the royal family are powerful. But don't you think we've been exposed to danger? I'm afraid yes. But it's not a time for us to panic. It is a time for us to brace up challenges. This is getting tough as it was in the beginning. But why are they fighting the royal family? Why? What else? Money, power, pride. These three things we must not let them take away from us. 
So any man without money, power, and pride is eventually not living. The death of our less. Don't you think the death of our less has made us to lose the trail of those fighting us? Not yet. I still have a lead that I am following and I believe it's going to be positive. That sounds good. Bring me up to speed. <laughs> I will shock you when we get to the palace. Stephanie, let's go. It can make us kill one another. Too much blood will flow like a river. It can make us turn against each other. Breaking the bonds we share. Roadblock wasn't here on my way to Mars's place. This is strange. <laughs> Don't make any move. Move. This way. This way. This way. Yes. Move this way. This way. Move. Faster. I'm sorry. Hey, shh. Shh. Keep moving. Keep moving. Yes. Where is Cynthia? Um, the money both of you drove out too. She drove out too. <laughs> if that's true, I will strangle her with my bare hands. Now I am confused. Like, what is really going on? What's going on? Yo, what's up? I've got her. Yeah, at the location. Please, I left my car at the track road. Take care of it. No, I left the key at the ignition. Okay. It can make us kill one another. Too much blood will flow like a river. She attempted to escape, but my boys got hold of her. As we speak, she is under the custody of my boys. You! My prince! Come here. You're coming with us. Okay. Why? Because my friend's car is parked along the expressway. He needs to drive it back to the palace. At least let me join you. Take care of the house. It can make us kill one another. So not blood will flow like a river. It can make us turn against each other. Breaking the bonds we share. Thompson. 
Thompson, what is the meaning of this? Shh! See, make I tell you. Your cup don't fool. It don't fool, they throw away. And the royal family wants to treat it. I, I don't know what you're talking about. What have I done? Shh. What? Or former is the person to question you, not me. So save your energy till he arrives. Now you listen. I will make sure Prince Ezenwa punishes you for this act of yours. What is wrong with you? Oh, baby. One more step. I swear you will lose your legs. What is going on here? Cynthia. I will ask you a few questions nicely. And I want you to answer me in simple terms. If I'm satisfied with your answers, which must be the truth, I will allow you go. It's, uh, okay. Go on with your questions, I'll, I'll answer. I'll ask you this question just once. Someone planted you in my life. I want to know who and why. My love, I don't I don't know what you're talking about. My love, nobody has <coughs> I will have no remorse in committing you into my brother's hands. Nobody. And you know what that means. You know what he will do to you in this ungodly place. So I will ask you this question just once. Once. I will repeat it once. Someone planted you in my life. I want to know who and why. My love, I swear I am saying the truth. I don't have answers to your question. Please, I, I haven't done anything. Ofoma, do the need for My brother left his room to my room yesterday night. You sneaked from the room into the car trunk in quest to find out what we are up to. I saw you from my room upstairs. Am I lying? She followed us. That was why I asked you not to touch Alex because I was using Alex to find out who she is and what she is up to. Coming back to find Alex dead simply means that she killed Alex. To avoid us knowing what you are up to. Right. It's not true. I didn't kill Alex. I haven't done anything. I don't know what he's talking about. My love, you know I would never hurt a fly. I didn't do anything. Ezenwa, you are the acting king. What are my orders? Use any necessary means to get the truth from her. My love, you, you, you know, I, I know you are a good man. You won't allow him to do that to me, please. <laughs> yes, I'm a good man. You've been playing on my intelligence by capitalizing on my good heart. 
to perpetrate evil against the royal family. But I'm happy. That ends now. Five seconds is all I give to you. If after five seconds you haven't said a word, I will shoot your knee one after the other. You know what it means not to have a knee? Five. Four. Okay, okay. okay. Three. Okay. I'll talk. I'll talk. I'll talk. I'll, I'll talk. Good. Talk. <laughs> is going to die today. Mm. And then we are going to be a step closer to royalty. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot wait to be at the corridors of power. Mm -hmm. Power! It's here, Ukamwe. It will happen very, very soon. I'm telling you. Very soon. It's here, Godnobi. Mune. What of a former? <laughs> what about a former? How do we take care of him? I am going to strike him from here. He's not a problem at all. Once we confirm from Cynthia that is why he's dead, then I will turn him off from this place. <laughs> 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 Bravo. Wow. What a great meeting. All the people were looking for in one roof, one place. What a coincidence. It is a force module, an act of the gods. Not a coincidence. My noble chiefs. Please, can you tell me what you guys are celebrating? Oh, boy. It's just a, a meeting of friends. Yes, yes. Get together of friends. And I must have to confess that you meet us well. I don't know whether you are disposed to start drinking from our cup or should I get your fresh cup? Eh? You, you can open this one more yourself. word from you. It will be or whatever it is you call yourself. You will be a dead man. Right? What has my father and the entire royal family done to you people to deserve this evil you've unleashed on us? What? What is he talking about? I don't know. Oh my God, about <laughs> we, we, are, we are enjoying ourselves drinking. So what are you talking about? You are enjoying yourself and you do not know. <laughs> you can as well you too. You. you don't know. You don't know. But that leads us to the wise saying that says um, action speaks louder than words. Maybe when I start to shoot your legs one after the other, you will start to. Maybe I should. <laughs> <you. laughs> to them. He poisoned Jack Franks. Last man standing. He wanted to say something before they died of your poison. No, he's not the last man standing because I am still standing. Thank you. 
divine sword should die by the sword. No. What should we do with this thing? From here she will leave. And never to come back to this kingdom. Love lost for power brings this unity in our midst. Love lost for power brings this unity in our midst. It can make us kill one another. Too much blood will flow like a river. It can make us turn against each other, breaking the bonds we share. Finally, our family is free. Yes, but one more thing. How to bring father out of coma. Do not worry. Mother is seriously working on that. Really? You are not welcome, even if I don't know where you went to. Stop working, how are you? I'm good. Where is mother? She's inside. She's with father. Princess Emma, there's a woman that's been waiting for you. She has been crying all day. I don't know why. Who? She said she's Messi's mother. Uh, all right. Let's go and see her. For power, raise this unity in our midst. Love, lost for power, raise this unity. Madam, who are you and what do you want? My name is Adane. I am Mercy's mother. It's over seven days now I've been trying to get her on phone, to, but to no avail. So I, I came to the palace to look for her. But I've just been told by other media and so that she's not in the palace. Is she missing? Madam, I'm aware of what you just said. Okay. We've reported it to the police. They're looking for her. Okay. Um, Madam, please, you would have to put yourself together. The police is seriously working on this issue. As soon as they get something concrete, we'll let you know. Yes, Madam, like my brother said, we'll let you know, please. My prince, mercy is all that I've got. Please, my prince, please look for my daughter. Please, okay. I'm begging you. It's okay. Please. It's okay. Um, please. Don't worry. Like my brother said, we will look for her. Okay? Stop crying. Oh, mercy. It's okay. <laughs> Madam, um, it's okay. I take this. Please. Take this, um, use it for transport, okay? okay? We'll get back to you, you can't go now. Okay, please. It's okay, Do all you can to find now. We will. Please, I'm begging you, please. Take him, man. Bye-bye, man. Okay, thank you. What again? I thought we were over this. Now this one crops up again.
what did you and your brother tell the woman about the disappearance of her child? We told her that the police are seriously looking for her and then they'll find her. Good job, son. Good job. But does your brother know the true story? No. Great. So it is between us? Yes, mother, it is between us. But please, mother, how are you going to fix this? Honestly, I don't know yet. But I'll figure it out. Oh, by the way, has um, Alex said anything meaningful? Mother, you will not believe this. Did you know that? So what are you going to do now? I don't know. There seems to be a moment of peace in the palace right now. Wrong approach to this will still a big trouble. I pray God gives you the wisdom to handle this. Amen. Amen. So what about Cynthia? Uh, what's up, Roger, please? I don't want to hear about that. That good for nothing girl. Okay. Do you know the enemies of the throne planted that idiot in my life? I don't understand. Don't worry, I will tell you the details later. Okay. Let me go and see father. I will skin that girl alive if I ever see her again. There will be no need for that mother. She is gone and will never return. What a world. Who will ever believe that the three most trusted elders are the ones now fighting the royal family? The more reason we all need to be careful, Mother. Is that why your uncle, Mazobi, refused the Olowo title when your father gave it to him? Father needs to be very careful with the kind of people he brings close to him. Imagine. Mm. Who would believe that Alex could be the one they would use to attack us? Son, it is not just your father that will need to be careful. We all need to be careful too. I mean, who knows what they are planning next. It pains me so much to see you like this, Father. I wish there is something I can do to rest all you back to normal. I miss you and I can't wait to have you back. A lot has happened while you were away on this sick bed. I will save you. The details for now. <laughs> but the good news is, <laughs> is that myself <laughs> and, and the former have destroyed those that put you in this condition. <laughs> That is the much we can do. I love you, Father. I will continue. I will continue praying for your healing and sound health. Love, lust for power brings this unit. 
rest until you tell my mother the truth. Tell her that I am dead and how I was killed. This is the first time I am begging you for a favor. Already you know it was the queen that killed me. It is no longer a secret. Please I am begging you. Help me and tell my mother that I am dead. And her endless expectation of me coming back to her because it's not possible. Please, she should know. Please, that I will never return to her. Please. It is obvious something went wrong at the dining. Now it is rude for you to walk out on mom like that. I'm here to ask what is going on. The spirit of mercy appeared while we were eating. What? Like, you saw her spirit. What does she want? She wants her mother to know that she's dead. She said she will not rest until her mother is made to understand that she's dead and gone forever. How are you going to do that? Now if you open your mouth to talk about what happened that night, you are going to implicate mother and that is trouble. I am not going to do that for mother. Mother will tell the story herself. All the poor girl wants is just her mother to know that she's dead and gone forever. Now you are sounding like a joker. You know mother will never do that. She will never compare to that. Sabrochi, so, don't worry about that. I will pressurize mother to do it. And she must do it. I smell trouble. You are breathing trouble. Don't worry, I'll handle it. You better think before you act. Huh? Mother, where are we going to? Just keep coming. Mother, that's what you said 20 minutes ago and all I've been saying is bush, bush, bush. It's getting deeper. Explain, well, what is going on? Son, the other time I told you that you will soon start your journey to being the king. You thought I was joking, right? Mother, are you seriously nursing the idea that when father dies, I will become king? Now you know that I'm serious. Love lost for power brings this unity now. 
Name like that. Hmm. Ngozi, we are going to disgrace ourselves here. After that, you and I will be sacked. <laughs> I don't have time for such nonsense. Come back here! You don't have time for such nonsense. Huh? Certainly, you are going to have my time today. Time without number, hey. I've warned you to hey. stay away from Prince of Omar, but you wouldn't listen. Today, we are going to disgrace ourselves. Hey, 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 hey. hey. Sophia. If you don't take your hands off me now, you won't like what you get. Hmm. She still have mouth to talk. Sophia, you shouldn't have done that. Ngozi, Ngo, wake up. What's going on here? Ngo, she didn't make you slap me now. Sophia, Sophia you have killed her. Oh, it was just a slap. Just a slap. Please wake up. She didn't make Please. What is going on here? My princess, it was so fell. She slapped and then she fell down and died. What did you do to her? My what did you do to her? Hey! Go and come here, Zimwa. Hurry up, hurry up! Awake. Be the one thanking you. I should also thank you too. Nara, please, what is going on here? Why are you both thanking each other? Let's go.
I have some questions and I want some answers. Go ahead. Who is she? Ah, she's the chosen one for you. For me? What do you, what do you mean, chosen one for me? Well, I guess I have to tell you this whole thing. When you were a baby, you were very sick. So sick that everybody thought you would die. I was scared. I ran to her mother, who was a sorcerer. I pleaded with her to save you, to save your life. She made it clear to me that your sickness was the handiwork of your father's enemies. She discovered that your destiny is to be king. I told her I was, I was ready to do anything for you to leave. And she made me two offers. What are the offers? She said first that I must become a sorcerer to protect not only you but the entire family. And that is why I am what I am today. Secondly, she said that her daughter, Urenwa, the lady we just met, is destined to be queen. And that as the king, you must marry her when you grow up. Yes. Mother, you don't make all the decisions for a toddler. Because when he comes of age, he would disagree to everything that you ever agreed. Sweetheart, you see, this particular agreement, you cannot reject. Because you are alive today, is because of that agreement that was made years ago. Yes. Yes. When you raise her hand, both of you were born dead spiritually. Nothing can separate both of you. Mother, I am in love with Ngozi. Does that make any meaning to you? Ngozi is dead. What? Oh, <laughs> hold on, man. You're joking, right? Son. You should know your mother by now. You should know that your mother does not joke with serious issues. I'm ready to take your second question. Okay. You... You were sad when, when you heard father is awake. Yes. I was sad because Gozi is dead. Her life was exchanged for your father. I was sad because she she's dead, not because your father is awake. Next question. You are confusing me the more. What is going on? A former. Can we continue this discussion at home? Let's go. Love, love Remember you have a card. Don't keep me with Brings this unity in our midst. Love, lost for power. Brings this unity in our midst. It can make a just like that. A former. Was she sick? No. A slap cannot kill a human being. 
Well, the truth is um, some diseases are not written on the face. That is why we must avoid every form of violence at all point in time. Your Highness, these men are here to see you. Greetings, Your Highness. Greetings, Her Majesty. Greetings, officers of the law. Thank you, sir. Uh, we came as soon as possible. Thanks for the urgent response. Ofoma, go and get Sophia for me. Be fast about it. And if I, if I may ask your highness, why the call? Well, a fight broke out in my palace between two maidens, and unfortunately, one of them died. So, where is the body of the dead one, and one that is still alive? Prince Ezenwa and uh, Princess Supruchi have taken the body to the mortuary, while Prince Ofoma has gone to bring the girl. Sir, in the course of the fight, was there any weapon used? Uh, no. It was just a slap as I was told. A slap? That goes a long way to explain that not all those seen walking freely on the streets are healthy. You can say that again. <laughs> oh, officers. This is the girl. <laughs> Your Highness, please, Your Majesty, please don't let them take me away. I don't want to go to jail, please. Young lady, you have been charged for murder. <laughs> and you have the right to remain silent. Whatever you do or say here will be held against you as evidence in the court of law. And in case you don't have a lawyer, the government will provide you one. The only thing I can do for you is to get a good lawyer that will represent you in the court of law. Take her away. Thank you, It can make us kill one another. Too much blood will flow like a river. It can make us turn For I have deposited her in the mortuary. That is the right thing you have done. Where is Sophia? Well, I was left with no choice than to call the police to come and pick her up. So she's at the police custody now? Exactly. It is a murder case and we do not need to conceal it. You did the right thing, Father. Your father is a courageous man that look evil in the face and deal with it. Learn from your father and do the needful. You must tell my mother that I am dead. Do it real fast. Son, sooner or later, people will find out about her death and it will be injurious on us if they discover that we did not inform the police. I understand, Father. My mother asked me to come here. That is why I'm here. It is time for you to assume the leadership of your land. Your father is living on borrowed time. And he must bless you before he joins his ancestors. Do you even know what you're talking about? My brother is there. Moreover, my father hates me so much. I will be the last person he will give his blessings to as his successor. 
you must make up your mind to assume the leadership. The good news is, your brother will willingly give the throne to you. That is not possible. With me, everything is possible. I will make you untouchable. You don't look happy, son. What is it? Mercy's mother was here the other day looking for her daughter. And I lied to her about Mrs. about. Since then, I've not had rest. I can't figure anything out from what you're saying. Mother, mother, you know what I'm talking about. Mother, you know how that girl died. All I want you to do is to tell the poor woman that her daughter is dead and will never return to her again. What do you mean by what you just said? That I know how she died. What's that? Mother, stop pretending. You told us you've stopped practicing sorcery. But you lied. Mercy was a victim of your sorcery act this time. The night my father fell ill, you and the former wrapped Mercy's body with a best spread and smuggled her out of this place. Enough! I will not have you insult me. Mother, deep down your heart, you know I'm saying the truth. After you and her former left that night, I went to your room. The yellow cloth, red candles which you normally use to practice sorcery, and a sharp knife stained with blood, which I believe is the blood of mercy. Mother, admit that you killed this girl. Admit it. Mother will leave, but you have three days, three days to do the needful. You don't look happy, mother. 
That's a serious problem. What is it? Your brother knows everything that happened. What? Uh, but, but how, how? How did he get to find out? From his narrations, it was obvious he saw everything that happened that night. This is not happening, God. So, so what are we, what, what are we going to do now? I don't know. God. But I think Uremwa will know. Oh, by the way, son, how did it go? It went well. I'm glad to hear that. I wish your father had accepted. He would have just been indestructible. Mother, you and I know that Father is a Christian. And he holds Christianity so close to his heart. There is no leadership position, my son, that does not go with a little sacrifice. You want to be a Christian? You should be well rooted. You want to follow the devil? You should also be well rooted. Nothing in life is easy. And I work at Leoji. Mother, I kept quiet back there at the throne room minutes ago because I gave you three days to tell my sister's mother about her death. Tomorrow is the third day. And after which you refused to tell that poor innocent woman about her daughter's death. I am sorry you leave me with no choice than to tell father all I know. Why are you blackmailing me? Why are you bent on destroying me? Far from it, mother. If I'm bent, on doing anything, I do the right thing. I'm out of here, mother. I have worked so hard for this day to come. Why is Ezemwa trying everything possible? to ruin it for me. I think I know what to do. How did it be? She's denying it. But I've given her to tomorrow to tell that poor innocent woman about her daughter's death. <laughs> but if she refused to do that, I will expose her. Honestly, I... I don't know what to say, but this... will get you into big trouble. You have to be careful. So, I care less... about what it will cause. If I'm bent on doing anything, I do the right thing. You cannot go to war with Mother. Mother is a powerful witch. You know that. Will she harm me? If you push her too far, you know she will harm you. Just stop! <laughs> Witches are very restless. They will go to any length just to keep their secret sacred. I beg you, please, don't do this. Please! Saprochi, she can't harm me. I'm her son. Her first son. Don't say that. I am begging you, please. I don't want to lose you. Please. It's okay. She won't harm us. Let's go. Love lost for power brings this unity. As in when my son is on my neck, he has vowed to expose the last ritual I made. And I don't want that to happen. That is why I am here. 
The only way is to stop him. How? You want to kill him? No. Well, whatever you intend to do, I just want you to have it in mind that he is my son. I wouldn't want anything to have adverse effect on him. I want to make him never to talk about it again. Then do it. Love, lust for power brings this unity in our midst. Love, lust for power brings this unity in our midst. It can make us kill one another. Too much blood will flow like a river. Breaking the bonds we share. You have to come to me this way. No! Good morning, how are you? Good. I hope you slept well. Yeah. And you? Yeah, I did. Okay. You're looking good this morning. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, are you still going to tell Mercy's mother about her death? Mercy? Who is Mercy? Did anyone die? The lady that fell victim of mother's sorcery. I can't remember we discussing such thing. Besides, oh, sorry, did we discuss anything like that? I believe we have one maiden in this palace. That's the person that served me this drink. Something is wrong somewhere. Sapucha, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Um, enjoy your drink. Uh, are you sure you're okay? It's okay. Do I also have to teach you to always knock on a door that is not yours before entering the room? Mother, you have succeeded. I hope you're happy now. What are you talking about? Prince Ezewa threatened to expose you to Messi's mother. And all of a sudden he lost his memory. He cannot even remember anything. Wow. So you want to join him now? 
in accusing me falsely? Maybe I have to refresh your memory a bit. It was in your presence that Ezemwa fell in the throne room, hit his head on the ground, and lost his memory. How is that my making? He threatened to expose you, mother, and all of a sudden he lost his memory. Can you reconcile that? No. I cannot. You reconcile it. Love lost for power brings this unity now. Who are you and what do you want? My friends, um, Adane, I'm Mercy's mother. Who is Mercy? My prince. Mercy is a maiden in this palace that disappeared. <laughs> but Adam, it's so disappointing that you're mistaking me for someone else in this palace. And for record's sake, I don't know you. We've not seen before, let alone to discuss about any missing girl or daughter. I don't know what you're talking about. Hey. Chimo, my prince, you can't you can't be saying that about my child. You promised to find out oh? that, that the matter is with the police when I came before. Yes, you said so. My prince, please don't do this to me. Mercy is my only child. Please, I'm begging Will you. Will you stop this? Please. Yeah, my, my, please. Don't touch you. Please, I'm begging you, my prince. Stop, don't just stop. stop begging who? Help me. Uh, God. Help me. Mercy is my only my child. Hey, 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 shh, shh. Hey, get, get out. Get out. Move. Once you ascend the throne, I will release him. By then, whatever accusation he lays against me will be inconsequential because you would be the king then. And you will have the final say. Love lost for power brings this power. Mama, please. Stop crying. Hmm? Please, I wouldn't want you to fall sick. Hmm? So why would the prince just be like that? You met a different prince today. I'm sure something is wrong somewhere. The prince that I know will not turn his back on you or anyone. Please stop crying. My daughter. I feel like killing myself. Hey, Mama, don't say that now. This is my only child. Please. Please, Mama, please stop crying. See, the king is all right now. I'll find a way for you to speak with him directly. Hmm? Will you do that for me? Sure. I'll do that for you. Now, what you would do for me is to please stop crying, Mama. Please. I miss Mercy too. I'm sure we'll do something. Yes, Mama. Thank you. Yes, Mama. As in one, my son, today marks the beginning of your journey to the throne. I have invited the great Dibia to witness it. Thereafter, he will take you to the shrine for fortification. Please come forward and receive my blessings. Father, what kind of insult is this? 
You have just insulted me and I don't like it. We have never discussed about me ascending the throne when you joined your ancestors. The right thing to do is to call me privately and discuss it with me before bringing it to the public. So what, my son, what are you talking about? We have been on this issue for days now, you know it. In fact, you told me to summon the SMO that you are ready to ascend the throne of your father. Father, I can condone anything from you, but not you lying against me. I don't like it. We have never discussed this. Something is wrong somewhere. For the records, I am not interested in being the king. A former my brother is here. If he's interested, you give it to him. But count me out. Count me out of ascending the throne. I have more important things to do with my life other than to be tied to a wooden and a locally exalted seat in the name of being a king. You will not walk out of daddy and mommy. This is not a <laughs> Father, what is going on? Your brother has disappointed me. He has broken my heart. Love <sighs> lost for power oh. brings this unity now missed. Love lost for power brings this unity now missed. It can make us kill one another. Not blood will flow like a river It can make us turn against each other Greetings, Princess Emma From our citizens Please, my Prince, can I speak with you? Make it brief. My prince, for some time now, you have not been yourself. You have been acting in direct opposite of who have come to know you to be. I heard that you rejected the king's blessing in preparation for your ascension to the throne. May I ask why? I am not supposed to discuss this with you, but I will. Let me ask you. Is it right for my father to take decision over something that concerns me? I mean, something that has to do with me without my consent, I mean, my input? No, but... The king that I know and the kind of relationship you have with him, I don't think he will take any decisions without your input. Well, he did. Even if he did, is that enough for you to say that you no longer want to be king? My prince, I think something is taking over you with the intention of destroying you. I know you can fight it. Resist it and it will flee from you. Please, my prince.
greetings. Something is wrong with Prince Ezewa, and I don't know what it is. His actions of recent has changed. He doesn't drink, he doesn't smoke, but right now he does all of that. You have to help him before something that is rightfully belongs to him will be transferred to another. Please. You are the princess, and that is the reason I am still listening to you. People do not come here and cry. Rather, they present their problems and see what the gods can do for them. I am sorry about that. But please, you have to help my brother. Please. Let me see what I can do to help him. Orarire e garagiri gororo. Orarire e garagiri gororo. Orarire e garagiri gororo. E garagiri gororo. E garagiri gororo. E garagiri gororo. Prince Ezenwa is under a powerful magic spell. Let me see what I can do to help you. Let me see what I can do. Egala, Egala Giri, Egala, Egala Giri, Gororo, Egala Giri, Egala. The powers holding him refuse to release him until a former is made king. Was that why the ground was vibrating? Yes. The vibration is a serious warning from them. They also warn that nobody must stand on their way, and that includes me. So, what am I going to do now? Do not stand in their way by going further to seek for any solution. To your brother's problem. But I tell you one thing. Kingship is beyond contest. Whoever the seat rightfully belongs to must sit on it. Love, lust for power brings this unity now. To be honest with you, I am heartbroken. Sorry, Your Highness. He acted the opposite of himself. His actions surprised me. But now the question is, what do we do? Get the family doctor to check up on him. Ezenwa is my first son. I cannot give up on him. How do exactly as you have said? But your highness, what if he insists on not being the king? No buts. Until we exhaust every available option. He's my first son. Love, lost for yes, power, brings this unity in our midst. Why do you look sad? Despite the fact you told me everything is fine. What troubles you? Look, I still do not believe that my brother will be there and I will ascend the throne. It looks very impossible to me. I understand how you feel. And it's natural for you to feel the way you're feeling no, right now. No, no, no. Look, you don't understand. I feel like I am betraying my own brother by taking his birthright. He is the first son. He deserves to sit on the throne when my father joins his ancestors. On the contrary, you know, you are born to succeed your father when he joins his ancestors. You have all it takes to be the king, so you will rule your people. Soon, you will ascend the throne. So brace up for the challenges ahead. Your brother's refusal to accept the king's blessings has given you the throne. Doctor, 
What is exactly wrong with my son? Hitting his head on the ground as a result of the fall has caused him to suffer amnesia. Oh, oh my oh. God. And that is why he cannot remember anything. With his present condition, he cannot assume any leadership position, not at all. Um, doctor, isn't there anything you can do to bring him out of this situation? Well, what we can do now is to prescribe drugs that we call it the anomaly. And my queen, you have to ensure that he takes the drugs. Okay, doctor. How long is it going to remain like that? I can't say for sure, Your Highness. Because I'm mean, the type of sickness that can take years, months, weeks, and if you are lucky, days. All he needs now is prayer and support. And I know he'll be fine. Okay, doctor. G get the drugs. I'll make sure he takes them. That's a problem, Queen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Your Highness, our time is limited and we cannot waste it. Give our former your blessing. He is your son. Give him your blessing now to avoid you dying with it. Um, don't get me wrong. I know it is hard for you. It is also hard for me, but we just have to do it. Good morning, my prince. Uh, good morning, doctor. How are you? How are you today? I'm fine. I'm happy to hear you are fine. I bought you some drugs. If you can take the drugs as prescribed, it will restore you to normal. I'll be able to remember all that you have forgotten. Dude, I tell you that something is wrong with me. Have I ever discussed with you that something is wrong with me? My prince, you don't need this. The more you get under it, the more you will see your situation. You don't need this. What is going on here? No, go ahead and tell me. Listen, any day I see you in this house, coming here to bring any drugs, I will kill you. Listen, what is going on? Who cares? Princess Enwa from this mess. He has lost control of his will and he may soon begin to harm himself. Please, dear Lord, help him. Son, I was made to understand that you have refused to take the drugs the doctor brought for you. Tell me it's a lie. Why is he giving me drugs? Do I look sick to him? The doctor said you're suffering from amnesia. And that you, you cannot take a leadership position in a condition like that. And father, who told you I'm interested in being the king? Oh, 
Oh, if that's the reason you brought me here, Father, I am sorry you failed. Listen, if my younger brother is interested in being the king, you, you, you give it, in fact, give it to a farmer. But you're my, you're my, you're my first son. What is, what is wrong with my son? Who did this to him? My king. <coughs> Your health deteriorates by the day. Give a former your blessing now that you are capable of doing so. God knows I I wish you quick recovery. But you need to do the needful. Please, my husband. That is my first son. Mama, <coughs> <coughs> what is it? My prince, I don't think I want to work in this palace anymore. One maiden suddenly disappeared. One is dead and the other is in police custody. I don't know what will happen to me next. Omar, nothing will happen to you. You're not going anywhere, okay? You're one of the best. In fact, you're the best in this palace. I assure you, nothing will happen to you, okay? That used to be guaranteed until you lost your mind. What? Don't tell me you're one of those who believe I lost my mind. Apologies, my prince. Just that lately, you really haven't been yourself. You forget things that have happened in the past. You get angry at the slightest provocation and then you destroy things. Which is really unlike you. It's okay. I will change. Is that a promise? Yes, it's a promise. Then why don't you go to the king's chamber right now and tell him that you are ready to assume your places? No. I don't want that throne. That throne is slavery. I don't want to be enslaved. I have a lot of things to do with my life. You may leave. You will be great, my son. What I could not do, you will do more. You will trample upon our enemies, and none of them can stand before you all the days of your life. You shall indeed become great, and you will rule the people even better than I have done. It is well with you, my son. Thank you One more that. thing. You must not marry from your mother's village. Their women are deep into sorcery. I thank God your mother is not like them. There will be consequences if you ever marry from your mother's village. Praise your former. Your journey to royalty just began. Tomorrow evening, come to the shrine. Let me start to teach you how to become a great leader. Thank you, Father. Mother, that is going to be a very big problem. How are we going to handle this? <sighs> I'll see Uremwa this night. I'll tell her everything that the king said. Then I'll listen to her to know what she has to say. I'm 
afraid. Father warned me that if I ever marry from your place, there will be severe consequences. You don't need to. Like I said earlier, I will see Urenwa. I... I hope this will be over soon. I hope there will be a way out of this. Love, last I so too. My husband said that if Prince of Foreman marries from my village, that there will be consequences. I knew he was going to say that. His people say our people are sorcerers. Same sorcery he practiced sustained him on the throne for over 35 years. Don't they have sorcerers in their village? Uremwa, I did not come here for you to cast aspersions on my husband and his people. I'm here for us to figure out how the whole thing can be averted if you finally get married to my son. I'm sorry about that. From the words of the king, if your son marries me, the king will come back from the dead and strikes him dead. Can you avert that? Oh, yes. Thank you. But first, I made him indestructible from humans. Now it is time to make him indestructible from spirit. Tell your son to visit me tomorrow night. Happen. Yesterday. Oh no. Yesterday. Oh. Hmm. Doesn't mean the hope of finding my daughter Mercy is lost. Mama, all hope is not lost. Let's not give up. I believe Princess Zenwa will soon regain consciousness and then he will help you look for your daughter. Hmm? Are you sure? We can only hope. Mm. Mm. Okay. Don't be sad. Swallow this. You're joking. There is no way I am going to swallow this. You must swallow it. Else, your father will strike you dead. Immediately you get married to me. And if you refuse to marry me, you will go mad. 
The choice is yours. Why did you disobey me and marry from your mother's village? Why? Oh. I, I'm sorry I disobeyed you, Father. But Father, she is an asset. With her by my side, I will conquer our enemies. She is a sorcerer. And you must not fraternize with her. Tonight. husband sex. He needs it and I want to give it to him. Rewa, please. He will die if he does it. Until you are completely transformed into human form. He will not die. I will use my magical precautions. He will not die. No. The risk is so much. I don't want to risk it. Please just exercise some kind of patience till you're completely transformed. Have I ever said anything and I didn't do it? No. Don't worry. So nothing will happen to him. Nothing will happen to my husband. He will not die. He is strong and knows how to satisfy a woman. What's the problem? He's dead. Dead? It's not possible. He was healthy last night. Yeah. I don't know what happened. We had to get a trial last night. I did every magical precautions. I don't know what happened. Oforma. Oforma. What did you do to my son? Right 
to me, okay, please. 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 Mom, is there a way out? Yes. Okay. I'll arrange his head on the pillow properly. Okay. I want you. I want you not to sleep with my son. But you refused. Now you have killed him. You stabbed him with a poisonous knife. Don't forget. We are in this together. So, we will die together. Mm. Ah! 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 Love lost for power brings this feeling. You're welcome, man. Thank you, honey. You see, in this life, there are so many things that we see in your life that might be complicated. And it is only those who survived it get its rewards. Truth cannot be covered. It can only be delayed. But one day, one day, it must be reviewed. Madam, I am sorry to have kept this away from you till now. Your daughter is dead. Thank you, Your Highness. I already know that she's dead. Um, Madam, we sympathize with you sincerely. If there is any way you want us to help you or assist you, we sure will do that. We are really sorry. Okay, thank you. To err is human and to forgive is divine. I hold no grudges against you. Thank you very much, Ma. Madam, you, you're kind. Thank you. Thank you, Your Highness. <laughs> you said that to her. Um, Mama, I don't know if you'd be interested in taking up a job as a head chef here in the palace. A chef? Thank you. Okay. I accept. Then, it's yours. <laughs> Thank you very much, Your Highness. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. I'm grateful. You're welcome. We're well, one family now, please. Feel at home, relax. This is your house. Okay. Please. And if there's anything. Love lost for power.